Hello, and thank you so much for purchasing the bandana. In order to add the bandana to your avatar, you're going to need to get a few things. The first is going to be the upload file, so you'll need to download this file right here. Then you'll also need Unity to add this onto your avatar. The Poyomi Toon Shader and the Avatar SDK and obviously an avatar to put the bandana onto. I'll put the links to all of these down in the description below. The next thing you're going to need to do is open up Unity and import your avatar package. If you're uploading one of my avatars, please check out one of my avatar upload tutorials. Now that you have your avatar put in, you are going to drag in the bandana Unity package. This might take a minute, so I'm going to fast forward in the video. You only need to import these next two things if you haven't already. So if you're uploading one of my avatars and you've already imported the VRChat SDK and the Poyomi Toon Shader, do not re-import these again. But if you haven't already, import both of these items. Now that everything's imported, we're going to open up the bandana folder and drag in the prefab into the hierarchy. It should look like this, and now we're going to unpack that prefab by right-clicking and selecting Unpack Prefab. Open up your avatar uh, in the hierarchy and drag it in. Now we're going to open up the armature and we need to attach this to the body. So open up the armature for the bandana and the armature for your avatar. We're going to need to find the chest, the neck, and the head. And so we're going to drag the chest into the avatar chest. Then we're going to find the neck for the bandana and drag it into the avatar neck and then find the head for the bandana and drag that into the avatar head. Now if we enter play mode, we can see that the bandana should be attached to the avatar. So if you want to change one of the materials on the bandana, you can head over into the materials folder and select any one of these materials and drag it on. So I have a ton of materials here. And so let's say you want it to be sparkly. You can drag on one of these materials and it should upload like that into VR chat. So we're going to go with some bones. All right. It is all ready to upload, so in order to upload it, head over to the VRChat SDK and then the control panel, and it's going to prompt you to log in. So do that now. And then once you're ready, hit build and publish for Windows. Okay, you can see the bandana is working in VR chat. Feel free to message me if you have any questions on Discord, email, or through Twitter. Thanks for watching.